Hey guys, be with you in a minute. Got some stuff out. Okay, so uh, I'm going to use some of these, you know, the daily gifts, the daily rewards we get when we log in. So I'm going to use one of these boosters. I think it's going to be this one. It runs out in two days. The other one runs out in eight days. So might as well use this one. And that's a 3%, as you can see, 3% to armor resistance, ship agility, turret, and missile damage, which may assist us. So... Yeah, I'll um, I'll redeem that one. Okay, and just a quick, just a little change on the on the Raven. Just this here. Just put the uh, large shield booster. Just if she does get, well, if anyone saw my last video, it's uh, she was getting a little bit damaged. Nothing to worry about, but I do like to uh, <coughs> micromanage wherever I can and keep it on top of things so uh yeah that's it so let's um let's crack on so i've accepted a mission and it's garista's extravaganza so garista's kinetic and thermal i've gone with the just two hardness here because again i simulate that if you have a look they're okay. I'm not expecting anything to axe in because we're at range. So, again, the tank doesn't matter too much. I've got the booster there as well. The uh, capacitor does deplete quickly, so it will have to be well micromanaged. So, anyway. So, this is in next door in Ruvis. And if we quickly look on the uh, mission report. I'll bring that up. And kinetic and thermal. thermal. Uh, there's quite a lot here. That's your uh, blitz. That's your blitz bit. Which, to, to be honest, it looks like you're going to kill all the ships. So, anyway. So, um, and it's been done by Gila, Ishtar, Navy Raven, and Avaga. Hmm. Okay, so if you're looking at the uh, first pocket, second pocket, then you have reinforcements in those pockets. Uh, third pocket and then reinforcements in that pocket. Fourth pocket and reinforcements in that one. Fifth, same. And finally, six. There's nothing in there, I don't think, that scrams you. If you have a look here, it's all webby and jamming. Uh, so, yeah. And it just you've got to just 
get you around these. Um, I will always go for the frigates anyway, just to get rid of them, but there is the Pith Eliminator there who does, they do jam as well. Okay, so just be aware. But at the range we're at, which is normally, what, 180, 190 kilometers, don't know if they can jam that far. But we'll see. <clears throat> so, let's, uh, Let's do this. It's not too bad. Loyalty points, 8,600. Isk. Yeah, it's okay. This might be one of those where you would want to... Where you would want to... Um, use a... Mobile... Uh, tractor unit. I'm not going to bother, guys. I'm not going to bother with salvage. But there'll be quite a bit of salvage. Um, if you've got another character, put them in an Octus, get it, get it fitted up, four and four, four, four tractor beams, four salvage, salvages on the top, um, and you can clear up very quickly. Anyway, let's, uh, let's get outside. We're going to go next door. Active. Gonna keep this skin on this. Looks doesn't look too bad. Other skins are available, of course. At a cost. I think we might have been given these or we might have just been a war just given them by CCP. Can't remember. That was a long time ago. So we'll see how we go with this. I've just kept the hammerheads. I'd rather have used um, Vespers to be honest, but hey. They're only just to clear up anything that comes remotely close to the, uh, the ship. Right, let's walk. Think. Warp drive active. Did they say? Let me just check that uh, mission report. Did they say they aggro as you go in? Doesn't say, does it? See. Okay. Well, we'll see how it goes. I've done these before, but it's a long time ago, so it's I'm just really doing them from the start again. hardness on again it's just going to be a 180 so I'm just going to do a 180 and jump micro jump there we go I'm going to lock these I like to see these gone straight away because they do they do deal a bit of damage for the for the size of them. There you go, so we'll use the booster and just bring that down. Let's get rid of that damage. We'll keep moving back. Plenty of range. And the shield <coughs> excuse me. The shield booster there just Clears up that little bit of damage. One more boost. That'll do. It's 
So these are... For what they are, they're, they're tough little cookies, those. Well, they deal out the damage. They, keep, they, they die very easily, but you, um, you deal out the damage. They deal out the damage and I say they die very quickly. So it's always best to get rid of the uh, the sentry towers first. So I'm just gonna I'm just gonna orbit the gate where we are now and just go from there. Better get these sensor boosters on. Does help. I was looking at a tur a, a, tur a top setup. Excuse me. Um, about thousand and sixty damage DPS, which pretty good. It's up close and personal. It's just trying to get that tank sorted and the cap. Um, I wanted to keep it. I wanted really to be a perma, bo a perma boost I could do it I'll just play a bit more with it I might do I might do a top raven it's, I've done it before it's doable like I said I didn't save the fitter or else could have just gone straight to it <coughs> excuse me um, yeah so I'll have a look at that later on and uh, see if I can do it. All Tech 2, of course. Um, yeah, it's All Tech 2. Nothing. Um, the, only, the only extra we've got today is that, uh, that booster I just took, which you guys might get it as well on your daily rewards. You know, on your login rewards. Oh, it's not something you you're not a module uh, has run out of capable of uh, of getting. Just approach the gate. If that's it, I'll kill these two first. I don't think there's another spawn on this. Could be wrong. Okay. Of course, I can't. Uh, can't walk to the gate. <clears throat> I'm gonna. I'm gonna quickly burn. I don't think. <clears throat> oh yeah, so I'm gonna overload that. Go to overload my micro drive. Pretty fast for a battleship. Okay, we'll call it no damage. Wow. That's pretty good. I don't want to use that jump drive just in case we do have to jump out in the next room. Could have used it and then sat on this gate and, you know, wasted time, but that's the only problem. I did a level 4 this morning with the uh, Tengu and just blitz. No, I didn't blitz it, I just burned through it, killed everything in a matter of no time. Like I said, the Raven's slower, but that's all you've got, that's all you've got. You know. We all started with nothing. Just 
reload that while I'm in. the jump just yet let's just see how this goes there's the webifier I think I need to kill him first I'm gonna drop my, drop my drones and get them on him What's wrong with that drill? Let's see if we can stay near the gate without getting some serious damage. Do have a little bit of a tank there, but we'll see. Okay. about now. There you go, it's the biggest spawn. Keep these orbiting. Let's kill that with the drone. Kill these little ones with the drones. They get to uh, Webby Farming. Yeah. Yeah, look, pith eliminated uh, jamming. Not doing a good job because I am quite close. Get the drones on that last one. We'll hit these. Put the drones on them. Put a little on that. Okay. Might be time to uh, jump away. the drones on him again okay yeah you a kill the little ones and they are uh, their triggers for your next you know, reinforcements so I'll bring the drones in and I'll do my jump and then make my way back in Start with the, with the big ones. I'm getting jammed. Surely that'll disappear, yeah. Say. So I'll look at the big ones. <coughs> Arika Tosh, you think, ooh, that's like a, an officer name. Nafal. Absolutely enough all in the wreck. Okay, I need to burn away. Yeah, we're gonna burn away.
try and uh, get out of range. Because they're hitting pretty hard. Next one. Just still hitting us. Another boost gets away. Range on these tor these uh, crews, 222. Locking range 187. Where are we? Oh, okay. Oh, 300, 300 kilometres uh, locking range. Oh, 187. I thought I was maxed out yesterday, but 300 is um, the furthest I've been able to lock up. The range. Oh, I know why. Because I've taken that uh, booster. So the range on the cruise is still 222. But because I've taken that booster, it's just boosted uh, locking range. A module has run out of charges. Which is good. Still hitting. <clears throat> Get rid of these. Let's go that way. A couple of boosts. Anything with the rave and the cap, not the best in the world. Okay, so we're looking. Good now, we should be okay. It's got this one to kill. He's just going over there. I think they're tops. It's firing tops. Nah, I've been on that range. Tops don't go that far. Of course, the rats have perfect skills, don't they? Mm -hmm. Right, so I'm just hitting him now. Excuse me. Just have my breath. Wasn't it? All those wasted cruise missiles. Right, I will approach the game now. I don't like it up on. Nice little keeler there. Yeah. Do like my keelers. <clears throat> so 
Sweet. A module has run out of charges. I'll be right back, guys. Got a quick thing. To, got a quick thing to do. We'll be right back. <laughs> Okay, sorry about that. Let's just carry on where we were. Well, we need to get back to the gate. I'm going to jump to the gate, guys, and just just wait until this uh, jump drive uh, regens. Okay. Cap recovered. Just going to boost the uh, shield. Gives you time to recover. This, I know it's boring getting to the gate, but this is how it is in a Raven. Sniping Raven, sorry. Above the gate, we don't want to get caught on it. Okay. It's pretty tough with a crap cap. Definitely recommend some implant, a uh, decent one as well, guys, if you can afford it. So, a couple of minutes, just now, uh, one minute, 20 seconds, before that uh, jump drive can be used again. Just being cautious, because uh, I could go in and not need it, but good chance I will. Yeah. 
There we go. Four seconds. I might as well start aligning. Right, might as well go. Warp drive active. Should be uh, ready when I get in. That was only the first pocket. We've got six pockets. So, we've had a good look. We just turn right and we will move away. I think I'm going to jump straight away this time. DPS is coming in thick and fast. I'm going to burn as well. Let's get those locked. You can see it's a constant struggle micromanaging that cap. Really is. I'm gonna put the booster on for a bit. Gotta get rid of these bloody things. So annoying. is pretty damn good. Get rid of these missile batches, they're the ones doing the damage. Tiddler. I might make a <clears throat> I might make a second jump guys away and just come back in at range. Like I say, 300 kilometer locking range plus 222 on the uh, cruise. <coughs> so I would be just out of range, but I can obviously come back in range. Take these out. Obviously, the little, like I say, the um, the lights are the triggers for the reinforcements. So if you wanted to avoid those and go for the big ones first, no problem. Okay, I'm going to make another jump. Still hitting me in that range. My God, now I'm in trouble. <laughs> yeah, I'm in trouble. <laughs> Which one is this? That it's the dismantler. My God, it's a damn good range.
Right. Need to burn a little. Just got to get rid of <clears throat> getting in range and rid getting rid of these big ones. There's more coming, but they're not aggro. Oh my god. So they're just coming into range now. Transversal up. Let's concentrate on getting these dead. Since I last didn't, they've obviously buffed the range of uh, of the rats. <coughs> Excuse me. Closer. Right, so shield should shield should recover now. No way those mediums should hit me. Oh god. He's <laughs> locked up. He's coming to range shortly. Big ones in range. Let's do it. Kill a big, two big ones before they uh, get any proper damage on her. Next one.
375 kinetic damage. Kill these two, that'll be another, might be another reinforcement spawn if I kill these two lights. I think, yeah, that'll be it. Need to start making way to the gate. See what the reinforcements come in with. down. You waste so much ammo from this distance. Let's go back to Orbison. A module has run out of charges. There we go. Another two lights. Let's get everything out. mediums I don't know if these two are trigger. I think this one's a trigger. Oh. We'll see. This one. I'll make my way to the gate. Distance. Oh. Is any me left it on? A module has run out of charges. Let's finish that one off. I 
that skin. Kaboom. from that new group. I'll just get this one killed and this one. dead. They're just not dying quick enough for me. I'm used to Tango. Kills. Tango. Ting. Tango kills. Right, well, let's, uh, let's get the little one. Oh, he's just out of range. Son of a. I'll reload. Is he staying? Oh, he's coming in. He's coming in. There we go. Start moving in towards the gate. Start burning in, I think. See if there's a spawn with this one. No, that's it. So now we can concentrate on the big boys. Move towards the gate, get in range, so I can just jump to it. <coughs> we, we will wait again, guys. For the uh, jump drive to regen. Well, cool down, whatever you want to call it. Cycles. Next. See, their venue just started to hit. Like I said, guys, if you want to salvage, there's plenty of salvage in this mission. It's one of those. 
Uh, blockade, that's another one you really do want to uh, salvage. Get a lot of stuff out of that, especially the, um, the insignias people want. Well worth salvaging. If I was doing this just on my own without streaming, I would have Fuzzy on and he would be following in a, in an Octus. Just, has just run out of tractor charges. beaming everything in. There, we have another spawn. So this time it was being the big boy. Better get rid of the light. little bugger. <laughs> okay, he's dead. It just doesn't know it yet. Oh, I don't know, I might have to hit him again. That one didn't do that much damage. Time, bad boy. There you go. Get repping. Plenty of cap right now. Big, big hole. Like I say, you waste a bit of ammo at this range, guys, but you've. It's Tech 1 ammo, so it's not hugely expensive. I don't mind wasting it. It's, it's no big deal. Let's bring that to a stop. Should just kill him off and reload. Sweet. A module has run out of charges. I'll just see if he's a trigger. I don't think he is. I think this is it. Let's approach. Just the gate. There you go. So uh, jobs are good in, we'll jump to the gate, and now we're on cooldown, which is three minutes. I don't know exactly line to that, did I? Big lump of rocks in the gate.
Okay. Just waiting on the uh, jump drive now. Quite a few wrecks out there, guys. Yeah. Well worth salvaging. Through all the six rooms, well worth it. Okay, give it a minute. We'll uh, be warping in. Okay. Hmm. Right, let's warp in. Warp drive active. Another boatload of, uh, Cruise missiles. Okay, so I'm going to go this way. I'm going to try and take these out quickly. Ooh, no, I'm not. That's, that's um, ouchy, ouchy. Little ends. from these have to burn a little bit okay so I just put one on each of those because they do die quickly <coughs> so I'll be rid of them pretty quickly Basically. There you go. Sweet. I'll bang everything on him. I'll kill that. Keep moving away from them. Bit of rep. this one doesn't trigger, I might leave that one and just get rid of some of these first because he's, he's at a dis decent distance. Okay. Boost it. Calls a fuse faction ammo, and you'll get a bit more DPS. Or you could use the um, has run out of charges. 
advance high precision. Again, not cheap. If you think on if you're in a Navy Raven, you got a better cap on the Navy Raven, and it has more roll bonuses. That's obviously one of the ships to consider from moving up from the standard Raven. Personally, I love my Tango. That's that's where I'm going to stay. I could get a Golem or a Paladin, but. Nah, not bothered. this little tiddler to last I think he will be the trigger let's have a look let's give it a try Try on the big ones because he's way out. Reload. Okay, let's finish the big ones off. <laughs> one slowly burning but 163 away missiles are falling short if you see see them incoming look there you go they're falling short of range this cat is so, and that one and that one <laughs> he'll be dead soon Now. 
Kind of need about two or three uh, salvos on on these. And I'll do a reload while we're here. Yeah. <clears throat> Boom. Let's finish this yeah, trigger. Should be a trigger. That's good. So let's go to the gate. I'll uh, burn a little bit to the gate. In fact, we will overheat. time so we've damaged a few things so we'll turn that off turn that off turn that off and repair repair and repair Two minutes. Okay. Back on, back on. That was slightly more damage than the others. Repaired. One minute fifteen left. It'd be great if you could dock there. If it wasn't ruins. Just gonna get in position. Face that way. Right, let's warp in. Done. This is the third room now. Blimey, three more to go. I don't know why they're blitzing now. That's close. It's very close. Let's 
kill the big ones. And those stinking uh, sentry, uh, sentry turrets. That's when we kill those first. Gonna die. Okay, was good to me. But they get again now. Current current distance. Just keeping us <clears throat> just at the top end. Pump that one. But these two actually I won't kill them. They're quite a way away. Get rid of the heavy stuff. We should be good. So anything with this setup, you just got to micromanage everything, keep your eye on everything. Get these two killed. Okay. So we like to say has run out of charges. Come on. It do take forever to get there. Okay, that's good. So that should just need a couple. Okay. Just one. All right, just one then. Let me drop my drones. The drones on them.
Okay. So we might get a spawn at the end of this one. There you go. Big ones and fiddlers. Oh, that reload should have reloaded sooner. I'll leave my drones out. If you are struggling guys you can always leave your drones out they, they'll get the aggro or get they might get some aggro take it away from you but you don't you don't all of the time but sometimes you do it just gives you that uh, respite There's one more in the pipe. Bloody isn't. Hate it when it does that. Seventy-two on the drones. Wondered what the range was. Okay, he's dead. Tiddler's killed. Go on, drones, you're taking your time. There really should be Vespers, but I hope. Finish that one off. Again. Drones are taking a sweet time with those little ones. Need to focus. Ah, okay, so the drones are being jammed. Blimey. 
And I've only got three left in space. That's right. Get rid of these guys. Okay. Let's reload. Come on drones, they need to focus. I'm gonna lose another drone in a minute. Yeah, they're only tech two. Meh. Close, but thanks. Kind of hold them with the odd odd rep or two or three. Drones are split up again. I keep doing that. So they are all on the drones, these four. That's all I mean by the drones taking taking damage for you. You know, it's actually not too bad. When I've killed them, I'm gonna split. Put my guns, don't need all of them on these. So, two on that one, two on that one, and two on that one. Oops. running good and a new spawn and there he is or she or he or it I don't know okay wait till these come in the drones can have them The 
looking good. with nearly a million. He's dead now. He just doesn't know that. Ooh. Yep, that's good. No, am I left here? Yeah. All the damage is coming in. Let's get the uh, guns on that one. A module has run out of charges. These will die pretty quickly. No more spawns, that's good. Ooh, that drone's nearly dead. It'll be limping back. I'm gonna bring him in. It'll be very slow, that drone. Okay, that's all those. Let's align to the gate. Let's reload while we're here. Should have had a repper on. I did, I took it off. You know, remote repper. I could have repaired all their armour. Hey ho. It's ten million for the bounties, not uh, not too bad. So we've got a couple of minutes. Reactivation delay. Cooldown period. Recharge, whatever. I mean, this has been a very long mission, guys. <laughs> in a raven, hour and a half in a raven to do... Uh, Angel Extravaganza. Sorry, Garist. Was that Angel? That's oh, Garist, isn't it? Yeah, Garist is. 
Oh. Ew. What else would I be doing on a Saturday morning? The noon. done it guys so show we show we do it don't know if I can go through this gate we'll see anyway I didn't think so and guess what I took out the Carissa's diamond tag <laughs> anyway so there you have it Carissa's extravaganza Um, obviously a little bit slower in a raven <laughs> um, I think the main thing will be for the oh those of you who can just about fly a raven and and use tech 2 then this this is fine you'll speed up you'll, your skills will increase you'll change your ships I think for me if, if it was me if I was learning I would certainly be going towards a Tengu um, and fitting it the way mine was fit and that really does just burn through the missions it's a great ship for that if we were in Tengu that wouldn't have taken us it would have taken us under an hour well under an hour in fact yeah well under an hour Drive active. So the bounties from that were there you go, five million five to twenty five million. All right, but they're kicking the teeth. If you'd have been salvaging, you would have uh, let's have a look what they say on the mission report sometimes they don't and they've not said it this time on this one no no okay docking permission requested docking request accepted Okay, let's tell her we've done it. Thank you very much. She won't forget this. Well, thank you very much. Alright guys, thanks again for watching. Uh, if you'd like what you see, please like and subscribe. And I'll be on again. I think we'll probably look at doing missions in, um, in a Gila next lot. So, yeah, look forward to seeing you all then. Bye-bye. Take care.